I've signed up for the London Landmarks Half Marathon and I'm running for a charity called Tommy's, a baby's charity, which uh, funds research uh, for premature babies, stillbirth and miscarriage. So running for all the women I know who've suffered and one day I'd love to deliver my own happy, healthy baby. So for those girls too. My body hates it. <laughs> Uh, no, I, I do enjoy running, uh, more more for its therapeutic side of it actually, more than anything else. Half marathon was always something I thought I might be able to do. When I first took up running, which was about 10 years ago, um, I, I, I just got up, I woke up early one Christmas day morning and thought I'm going to go for a, try and go for a run. I lasted five minutes and I thought I was going to die. <laughs> hard especially on those grey days when you're all snuggled in bed and you just think oh I've got to get out there but then once you've got your kit on and you just get outside and you've taken in that fresh air you just it's just one foot in front of the other at the end of the day and I'm actually so surprised by how much my body has adapted and now I almost feel like I crave to run and if you're with someone who's quite a fast runner, it does push you. I, I felt like yeah. I've achieved my personal best when I'm with someone who's a runner, um, and they almost slowed, they slow down for me. <laughs> you get the pressures of life with a bit of work, home or whatever, and you're always on call with somebody, aren't you, in your life. When you're out running, nobody can get to you at all. And I just think about things while I'm running, because I, mm. I think your mind automatically tries to block out the fact that you're running. I think what I've really found useful is never to put pressure on myself to get a certain time. I mean, this is my first ever half marathon, so just getting out there and being able to complete a distance is such an achievement in itself. Mm -hmm.